Hey everybody, it's Leslie from therealclearisrael.org. I know my face looks really happy right now, but I just came back from a rally downtown in Vancouver with the Jewish Defense League. Um, there was We were doing a counter rally to uh, pro-Hamas, yes, pro-Hamas, anti-Israel uh, little gathering they had down there, if you can believe this. They actually had signs that said, Israel stopped the war against Gaza. So, I my I was a bit riled up with that. So, for the first time in my life, I took the foghorn from the guys. They said, you look like you want to say something. I took the foghorn, and I started to say the truth very loudly through this foghorn into uh, this crowd, such as things like Hamas commits double war crimes by shooting rockets at... Israeli civilians and holding their own people as human shields. Uh, there's 1,700 um, millionaires in Gaza after they steal the money that's supposed to go to the people. Um, there is no apartheid in Israel, blah, 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 blah. So I went down the line of all these talking points that are actually true. And these people were quite shocked that somebody was actually saying the truth to them. But anyway, it looks like now I'm sort of like this foghorn activist. I'm kind of going from one level to the other. But I'm, I'm sick and tired of this lies and, and, and BS. There's a worldwide, um, it's coming from Islam and the left. And they're trying to demonize the Jews to the point that they will no longer be human. So that when they are attacked by, you know, ter uh, global Islamic jihad, which they are on an almost daily basis, but when Jews are killed anywhere in the world, it won't matter because the Jews will be demonized. And you know what? I'm not putting up with that. I am putting a stop to it because I know history. I know that this happened in 1930s Germany, and look where it took us. So I called these people. Um, through the foghorn, uh, useful idiots, because that's exactly what they are, and I'm going to be fighting this fight with everything I've got, because I'm telling you, I am sick and tired of this, and I think they're even planning, it, planning an Al-Quds Day here in Vancouver on July the 18th, well, I, I will be there, and I will be speaking into that foghorn again, because now that I've found my voice doing this, look, I'm a, I'm a nice Canadian girl. I like to be sort of demure and quiet to a point, but foghorns, whoever did those, I mean, not me, but trust me, I'm going to be doing it because the guys I was with were actually very surprised and very impressed. So I'm just letting you guys know that this is what happened tonight. I'm still a bit excited, as you can tell, I'm a bit incensed that this is actually happening in my city. This lies and, and dehumanization of Jewish people. And it's not going to happen under my watch. So, there you have it. Have a wonderful summer, and you'll be hearing from me more and more. Anyway, and thank you for watching, everybody. Lots of love, lots of hugs, and shalom.